It's shooting. Did you shoot too? One in one. <laughs> one in one. <laughs> All right. Hi, folks. Welcome to this episode of Carolina Outdoors. Here. On today's show, we're out in Bladenboro, North Carolina. It's a little chilly this morning. It's a perfect time to go quail hunting. We've got the dogs, we've got the quail, we've got a couple already down. We've got some special guests from Sunbelt Reynolds. Some exciting quail action coming up right here on Carolina Outdoors. Y'all stay tuned. Yes, yes, yes. Look at that, that's pretty. All right, folks, we got father and son team out here this morning from Sunbat Reynolds. Mr. Jim, his son AJ. And you see AJ now, we'll tell you, he's only 14. I hope he's playing football somewhere. He's a big one. But he got his first quail a few minutes ago. And he's having a ball. I love getting the kids out and having a ball like this right here. You having fun? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, a lot of fun. Oh, yeah, pretty. Back him up. Come in a little bit. Pretty, pretty. Yeah. Oh. Man, it's such a pretty morning out here this morning. In the low 40s. Good. Hey! Good shot, boy. Good shot. Let me get your gun barrel past my ear. Oh, that's pretty right there. My quill probably down that little ditch. There it goes. Come on, big boy, you done good. <laughs> hey. Knock him down, AJ. <laughs> Hi right, folks, I'm here with Jim Cowley and it's about Reynolds and we're here with his son out doing a little shooting this morning. First time AJ's been out. First time quail hunting, yeah. I think he's having a ball. He is. He's doing he's, pretty good. Too. He's, he's out shooting everybody. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, tell folks at home a little bit about Sunbelt. Well, Sunbelt Reynolds is a full service rental company. We have um, divisions that take care of many needs um, like pumps, generators, general tool needs, everything from large man lifts all the way down to lawn and garden equipment. Um, we're one of the only real full service rental companies left out there. Um, Sunbelt's a great company, great solutions provider uh, for folks and uh, we have a wide, wide variety of equipment. Right. That's uh, suited to everyone's needs. Just about. Well, what, what, where's the biggest focus? I mean, I, I know you guys are certainly in, in South and North Carolina, but how much more area do you guys really cover? Well, we're all over the U.S. Wow. Pretty much. Yeah. Um, we have we have certain areas that we um, that um, we have some lighter coverage, but we're primarily a southeastern company is where right. our, our real strength is. But we're expanding. We're adding over a hundred locations this year. Uh, I just added a new location up in the Asheville, North Carolina area. So uh, any of the places that we were uh, thin, we're adding locations as uh, major metropolitan areas grow. We like to surround those areas and uh, so we can provide full service to, to folks in those areas. Well, there's a lot of rental places out there, but I see Sunbelt everywhere, and they seem to be one of the biggest ones, if not the biggest ones out there. What is it that makes Sunbelt? such an attraction well um, visually it's our color right <laughs> our sunbelt green is very identifiable out on a job um, we have a uh, sales force that um, combs the area uh, I have uh, 16 sales reps in my area what we call upstate South Carolina um, I cover all the way from uh, Florence to Asheville to Augusta um, Columbia area and all over the upstate 
Well, I'll tell you one thing I'm impressed with. When we go to Sunbelt, we need to rent something, whether it be for the job site or just something for the house, you know, something need for the the house. But I can give them a call, tell you what I need, come by. There's somebody there going to be waiting on me, help me hook it up to the truck. When I get back with it, they'll help me hook, unhook it, check everything out, make sure everything's working right. It's the customer service. It, like. it is. We, we've... Um, we take good pride in our customer service and uh, also our safety as well. We have a great safety culture at Sunbelt, and we want to make sure our customers are safe and doing the right things, especially with uh, when you just mentioned towing. There's a lot of DOT rules and regulations. Oh, yeah. We want Absolutely. to make sure the customer is educated on that before Absolutely. they leave. So, you know, we don't bend the rules in those areas at all. And uh, we want to make sure our customers are safe as well as our employees. That's right. Well, I appreciate you and AJ coming out. What do you think about this place? It's beautiful, yeah. beautiful place. It's uh, it's something else. <laughs> it's hard to describe to people. They almost have to bring them here to, yeah. to see it. But yeah, it's uh, awesome. It's a lot of fun. It really is. Thank you for coming out. Okay, thank Let's you. Let's get you some more birds. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. I'm with you. Yeah. All right, there's that bird. I see it. It's right behind the tree. Uh -oh. You see him right there, Billy? Oh, yeah, that's pretty right there. That's pretty right there. Go to the dog. Okay. And you don't get into this right here. So AJ. Oh, look at that. Get Good it job. Good AJ. Oh, Lord. It. <laughs> if he had a gun that would shoot twice, he'd be dangerous. Good boy. <laughs> yeah. Oh. And we're back up on another point. Oh, what is quail? All right, here. I see a quail. Yeah, to be here somewhere. Oh, right there, AJ. Oh, oh! Woo! AJ! That's a double. Jimmy won't give you a chance to get it up! <laughs> <laughs> Quick draw! Come on! I don't know. <laughs> Come on, Oh. Come on. How about that one, AJ? <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> Hi right, folks, we're here with AJ, Jim's son, came down yesterday, spent the night, we had a nice fire, we had some good food, how about the food last night? <laughs> Sir, the food, was, the food was amazing, that pig. <laughs> the food here is incredible. The facilities, where you had your own room, had your own bathroom, had your own Oh, oh man, they're, they're great. I've, I've stayed in some other hunting lodges and I gotta say that's probably one of the best rooms I've stayed in. What about the quail hunting? This is your first chance, first opportunity to go quail hunting. Yes, sir, this is, and I gotta say, it, it's all that I expected it to be and more. Yeah. It is so fun just going out here. It's, you know, not quiet or anything like deer hunting. You can go and interact with people and, you know, have fun. I've shot a lot today, which is always fun, and I've gotten a lot of birds. Well, you got to come out, and the first thing we did this morning, we went through a little safety course, a little safety video, which was good, yes, I think, for everybody to see that. So oh, definitely. On the and then, of course, we also, you got the chance to go shoot some sporting clay to kind of warm up a little bit. Yeah. That's always fun. Yeah. <laughs> and it worked because first bird got up, first shot, first bird down. That right. Yeah, um, almost every bird that I've shot, most every bird that I've shot at, I've gotten. Awesome, awesome. I'm glad you're having a good time. I'm glad you came out. We're going to go shoot some more birds. Let's go. All right. There he goes. <laughs> now that right there, <laughs> that's what I call father-son tag team action right there. <laughs> that bird didn't stand a chance. Man, we having a ball out here. You got to come out here to Allen Brothers Hunt and Preserve. Awesome. We're going to go hunt some more. Y'all stay tuned. We're going to be right back. Woo, we having fun. All right, folks, we take a little break from the field. We're here with Mr. R.J. Allen, one of the two Allen brothers. Yes, got sir. got Mr. Joe's your other brother. And uh, we're here in Bladenboro, North Carolina, Allen Brothers, Hunt and Preserve. Tell us a little bit what you got going on here, R.J. Bill, I am so tickled to have you with us today. Uh, brother Joe and I started uh, quail hunting, just quail hunting, check it out, um, probably 10 years ago. And we just started uh, quail hunting because we had the plantation pines and that just kind of led to another thing. He said, you know, we love your quail hunt. I said, how about a duck impoundment? And uh, so we built a duck impoundment, shot the ducks. Then he said, how about a pheasant tower shoot? Put up a pheasant tower shoot and so now we can have the tri-factor. You can come in and hunt with us. Uh, 
So on a Friday afternoon, you can come into a guided quail hunt, plantation pines. Uh, you can shoot the lodge with us. Come stay with us. We can sleep about 28. Brother's the best cook you got. You won't find grandma's cooking anywhere. Right about you know that. that I now. guarantee you that. <laughs> <laughs> he is the man with the plan with the spoon. Uh, Brother Joe will cook for you. We've got great facilities as far as lodging. Um, it's juniper inside. Oh, it smells great. Too. And uh, we got everybody's got their pi private bathrooms. That's and right. you got your own TVs. we got a, a big game room or a relaxing room with a big TV and a pool room. That's right. And, um, we got, I think we got good facilities out to put up against anybody. Of course, at night, what they like is that fire. That's right. They love it out by the fire at night. And some of the boys come from up north or down south and said, where do you get all these stars at? <laughs> <laughs> I said, I brought them in just for you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and then from there, what we'll do the next day is get up. We'll have an early uh, duck hunt, guided duck hunt, or quail hunt, whichever, uh, whichever you prefer. Uh, we'll get in and um, we'll have lunch, and then we can quail hunt in the afternoon or um, deer hunt. We also got some deer hunt going on. And uh, we always dress your birds in the price. That's part of it. And we got some outstanding guides. The guides work their dogs year round. Right. And they're, I put them against anybody. They're right. good. They're good dogs. Um, the way we design our courses is like we like to hunt when we grew up. Um, we like to kind of hunt the ducks in the little cubby holes around in the swamps. And um, I think you'll like a setup if you come visit with us. Now, the, now the uh, quail hunting, obviously, in pan, plantation pines. And uh, I believe you had a, chunk, a chance to hunt oh, in there. Oh, yeah. That was awesome this morning. It really was. I mean, it's just it's more natural authentic type of shooting you know, instead of just a field where you got to kick the birds up almost now here we have the pines and it's the challenge to shoot through the pines and you made a comment while we were out there could you sell some timber what was that comment tell everybody what you said yeah, the boys come in and they say you know uh, I would have done better on my bird hunting, but uh, I wind up shooting your pine trees. And I said, well, boys, that's all right, because what I do is when I sell pines, I sell it by the ton, so it's, it's a win-win, <laughs> so it's a double winner. crop. It's a I double like crop. <laughs> but the birds cooperated. It was so authentic this morning, folks. It was, I mean, we chased birds for several hours because they would get up, and it was just so difficult to shoot, a challenge, and then we'd go on those birds again, and the dogs were awesome. It was just an awesome hunt this morning. It really was. You know, we uh, do a lot of spraying. We do a lot of burning uh, for our plantation pines. Uh, we take it serious here. We want, we want the client to come and uh, bring his, his uh, son or his, his daughter, his wife, or whoever it may be, and make some memories. Right. And we call it making memories. Uh, when you come to the Allen Brothers, we try to get a photo of you because we don't have a chance to live this day over again. And That's we right. make some memories and tuck it away, and 10, 15 years you look back and, 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 and what, a, what a day it was. Well, the, the facilities here, as you were talking about, with the private room, the private bath, the private shower, makes it all worthwhile. And then the way you guys have decorated this place, with all the <laughs> memoirs in here, it's, it's, it's just awesome. Yeah, they call us uh, the local pickers. Uh, if you look at our facilities around, we, we grew up uh, grandma and granddaddy around, and we like the old-fashioned uh, roll back in time. And it's kind of set back here in Bladenboro, Bladenboro, North Carolina. A lot of people haven't heard of us. Uh, we're about 15 minutes from the interstate off of 95, and we get a lot of clients from up north and south. We've had them from Russia, Singapore, China, France, India. Uh, website really helps us out a lot, oh, but yeah. uh, word of mouth is the best. That's, That's right. the best. Well, how do folks get in touch with you? I mean, you got the website. What's the website, and what's the number for people to call? Right. Uh, the website is, is allenbrothers.org. And the, web, the website is allenbrothers.org. And you look on there, and you'll, you might find your photo posted on there after some hunts. And the phone number, you can reach me. And i got the phone in my pocket. It's got a quail ringer on it. Some right. of you heard say, hey, that's my kind of talking <laughs> Bob, right Bob, there. Well, that's right. It's 910-736-5360. Uh, All right. Well, you guys have top-notch facilities. I was telling you yesterday when we were riding around looking, I've been to a lot of plantations and a lot of preserves. This is top-notch. You guys are hands down above a lot of people I've ever been to. Well, thank you, Bill. Yeah. I appreciate it. I know you've seen a lot, and I'm glad you come to visit this with us awesome. and brought we the crew in, and um, hope you'll come back. Absolutely. We will be back. Thank you, RJ. Thank you, brother. Yes, thank sir. Thank you, sir. Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> hey, he's getting high now, AJ. You gotta back up. Come on, boss. <laughs> Using yeah. my line of fire. I couldn't have shot at that. Yeah. <laughs> Come back. Damn, you. The first one Come back. Sure from half time, Jill, that thing? and stepped up to the plate. You obliterated that thing. That's your word. That's your There it goes. Well, 
you better be quick this morning. <laughs> they are flying really well this morning. I would be prepared. All right, you ready? Yep. It's about to happen. There it goes. Good shoot. I believe Jim got that one. I couldn't have. <laughs> Daddy got him. Oh. Good job, Dad. Good job, Dave. Good shot, boy. Get him, bring him on, Dad. My bird. Get him, Dad. Actually, that is what's in that. It's modified. No, it is. We can take it out. AJ knocks another one down. Dad. Y'all need to come out of this place. This is Dad. phenomenal. The facilities, hunting for the pines. Old Southern Plantation style. Good boy. I'm not even going to talk about the food. It's, it's, I gained 20 pounds while I've been here in two boy. days. It's ridiculous. Good Allen job. Brothers, two brothers, RJ and Joe. Got to come out and meet these folks. Excellent, top notch right. facility. Let's turn on We're going to shoot right the birds. Come on. Thanks for watching Carolina Outdoors. More information and other great shows are at scoutdoors.com. See you next week on Carolina Outdoors.